Our heroes have been summoned to a spiritual plane above Acheron, a safe place known only to the Jesidon Council, the highest clergy of Weejas, the goddess of knowledge and death. The Council has interpreted that major celestial disturbances lie ahead for the entire realm if a battle between Weejas and Helios is not prevented before the next waxing moon. They are tasked with being the couriers of a parcel, the contents of which are yet unknown. Dividends are bountiful should they succeed. They are to head west immediately. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Some Would Play featuring Rico. My name is Pan Halsian. I am a half-elf paladin. We got Matt. My name is Ari Futon. I am a dragonborn monk. And Daphne. I am Gilsai Ravenfire, and I am a half druid. And switching seats, we got Deborah. And I am now Neith, a human rogue. And I am Jenna, your dungeon master. All right, so in the last episode of Dragon Ball Z, we find <laughs> Snake Way. No, I'm just kidding. Um, <clears throat> we were at uh, the uh, Grendel and Grenda's hut, whatever their names were. Brendel and Brenda. Yeah, that was it, Brendel No and relation. Oh, they were the best. <clears throat> yeah, they were pretty chill. Um, there was a skull on the lunar dial that we found out. Um, it had uh, moon cycles on it with four coin-sized depressions. Um, there were pillars around this, uh, lunar dial. Um, there was a North Pillar, East, South, West Pillar. Um, the North Pillar had a carved portrait of Weejas. There was a well there, and in that well was water that only looks red whilst in the well. Um, it stopped being red when the water escaped from the well, tasted just like water. The Weejas coins that we had had cardinal directions on them, so we placed them in the lunar dial. God there. damn, Re- this is the best recap you've done. Nah, nothing was better than going over the wall. Oh, that was the best one. <laughs> that's that was yeah. Great. When we put the coins in the lunar dial, this fire erupted from the lunar dial, and it shows the the, the full moon phase. We learned from Brenda and Brendel that if we just had anything to communicate to us, we would use these lunar dials. Um, that's what these lunar dials were for. They were, if we just had messages to give to anybody, they could receive said messages from these lunar dials. Then there was some chanting at the well, the the red water well. Um, out from the well, Gelsira got Cedric back, her little owl Yay! companion. Cedric came back. Neith got a rapier that manifested from the well. These were gifts from Weejas and Brenda and Brendel. Pan didn't get anything. Ari didn't get anything. Um, and we were instructed to take some canoes west because our journey is to just tr- continue going west. So um, as we're getting ready to leave and hop in the water in our canoes, uh, Brenda and Brendel gave us um, a warning. Um, they said that we were to hunt during the day, that we would be hunted at nighttime. Someone is always oh, wait, watching no, us. No, that's the opposite, right? No, 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 this is your words verbatim. Yeah, hunted at night. Hunt during uh, the day, you'll be hunted at night. Someone's always watching. Oh, all right. Never mind. I misunderstood. And then we could smell burning cedar on the wind. We're not sure why. We killed it. Probably. <laughs> um, so we started to take these canoes. Um, yeah, you do have a penchant west. for like just whacking trees. So Then as we were taking these canoes, we were lured by a siren that was calling us to our death at the bottom of a waterfall. No, guys, we really got to go see. We really got to go see. Check this out. Do you guys hear that? And You remember um, when you guys... (laughs) I remember (laughs) that Neith pulled out a mirror and broke the entrancement on Pan and Ari. Which, by the way, was brilliant. I loved that. Thank you. That was so creative. And Ari had a hard time breaking the enchantment um, and was fighting us as we were trying to get him out of the water. He was just going to go down 
the side of the waterfall like an idiot. Are you um, down? Are you down? But at the like the zero moment we break him of his enchantment not that it would have mattered because he jumps down and slow falls <laughs> down the waterfall anywhere where he finds a uh, little loot hole a uh, little looty hole behind always the check the waterfall always as you guys know <laughs> there's always a loot hole behind the like waterfall I feel like we're in Zelda now <laughs> <laughs> and uh, he was down there looting for a little while we started to build a camp um, at the top of the waterfall. Yeah, me too, please. Please, me too, please, Deborah. Like me too. Yep. <laughs> and as night began to fall, um, the rest of us were building a camp at the top of the waterfall, waiting for Ari to come back up or for us to find out if he's dead. My guess is Thank that you. he's dead. And we bedded down for the evening for camp, and that is exactly where we left off on Season 2, Episode 4 of Some Would Play. Ari scales back up the waterfall successfully. Boom, boom. Yay! Thanks, I Ari. use I use slow climb. <laughs> he meets you guys in an hour. <laughs> <laughs> Neith uh, is slowly climbing. Not Neith. Uh, Ari slowly climbing. So does everyone... I, I just want to make sure everyone understands we will be traveling at night. Will we be... Sleeping during the day. Doing our poops and peeps during the day? You don't stop. <laughs> so I don't you just pee on the way. <laughs> pee on the way. Okay, so everyone's rested. Let's see, it was like uh it was evening time, right? Right. And then okay, um See no whoa, whoa, now I'm confused. So are we hunted during the day or are we hunted during the night? You're we being hunt <laughs> during the day. We are hunted during the night. Right. So then why should we be traveling at night? Because the DM told us to. I wrote hunt at night, hunted during day. See, I have... You want to be awake when you're being hunted, is what my... my... See, that didn't make any sense yeah, to so me. Yeah, so have to be so awake during the day. I took it as, like, I need to be hiding, and so where I can't be found. Well, the intention was to take us into the nighttime. Okay, well... And then I got super confused. Yeah, sorry that that we was not good. At night. Well, I mean, it <laughs> says hunt at night, so I think it wants us to be awake at night hunting, and but we're being hunted during the day, so that sucks. I think I just wrote it wrong. But so we how don't are get we to supposed sleep. to hunt during the day if we're asleep during the day? I think, guys, I think I just wrote it wrong <laughs> and read it wrong in so my which head. Which way? How about sleep this? during the day, travel at night. Okay. But we're being hunted while sleeping. No, I was. Maybe I, our druid can have like a vision. I was just wrong, <laughs> <laughs> y'all. Just, I'm sorry. I was confused. I know. I'm glad you clarified. That's good. I'm, it's clear as mud. I so was now wrong. it's clear so as now mud. it's morning. So we should be like, oh, we want to go back to sleep. We're dead. Um, <laughs> we, we, we are going to. You can. Can, um, can I go down the waterfall and loot? No, I don't want that. <laughs> I thought you did want that. I'm so confused. That's true. I did say always check the waterfall. If you want to, let, we can play. I mean, because I did, I did see Ari go down behind the waterfall. You did. I was there at the edge of the waterfall. You were. And then I thought we had to end the episode. If you're interested, if that's something that we can, that is easy to do and I happy to do it. I love giving people shit. All right. So I ate my breakfast and I just walked to the edge of the waterfall and start climbing down. I like to wave to you as you pass. Look at all this <laughs> shit I got. <laughs> How far down is it? It's down there. Um, I think we said thirty feet or something. Is oh, I have. A, I do have a question. Yeah. As being me, um, how deep is the water at the bottom of the waterfall? It isn't deep. It's just, okay. Yeah. It's it's really. Um, is it above my head? Or a jelly pan key. You're elsewhere. human sized. <laughs> yes. Yeah. You you could swim in it, but it's not like I can't swim. Oh. <laughs> oh. So I All right. climb Nathan's down dead. on the character. side of the yeah, waterfall, I can't know that. and when I, I get to that. the bottom, I try to like leap. You didn't feel like attaching a rope or something, or asking a buddy for help. I mean, I have <laughs> acrobatic, athletics, no and here. stealth, <laughs> so I feel like I could do it. Okay, well, roll for um, roll for strength. Ooh, okay. Can I roll for strength? Awesome. So for strength, I'm going to use my athletics, so I get a times two for my ability check. Okay. Okay. Um, it's like 
plus two, isn't it? No, I get two. my. I actually get my. She gets her double, double her modifier. So I have a one for strength, and then I get that doubled. It's a multiplied. Hmm. I looked it up, hmm. um, but it's still only an eleven. <laughs> you oh no! Fall in. You fall oh, in. Oh no! <laughs> yep. Ari, are you? Ari still slow water. climbing. So <laughs> Ari's. Ari, roll for perception. Jesus Christ. See, this is why you can't plan things for this fucking game. Well, Jesus is good. <laughs> Five. The number? Yeah. All right. well, Ari doesn't like, see you. Am I still really near the shore? Can I like try to grab? There's a lot of rocks. It's very, there's. Okay, can I try to grab one? Uh, Yes. Uh, Let's have you roll for. Dexterity. Dex. Yay. Okay. Ooh. Um. So 13 plus eight. Eight. You got it. So twenty one. Yay! What do I grab? Do I grab the shore? Something on the shore? I can you c- in up. my head. You're climbing up, uh, like a boulder. Where's the boulder at? On like, the right side. In the water, like on it, the half in the water, half shore. Cool. Okay, so like I could climb up on the boulder, and then I hop off the boulder onto the shore. You're very close to the waterfall. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so can I like hop? You can off hop the boulder, into it. Into I think. The water. Yeah, I, I think that. you're that close. Okay, okay. Cool. I do that. All right. Uh, start. little little slip. Nobody saw me. Start rolling. <laughs> what am I rolling? D twenty. Uh, I think. Is, <clears throat> is it that? How or do I do the one hundred? Let's do. Okay, Which ones? I have what? I use my percentile. Yes. And my what other one do I roll? Uh, the ten. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Not a ten. Thirty-two. Potion of clairvoyance. Roll one more time. Eighty-seven. The fuck's a drift globe? Ooh, I that don't know. That sounds cool. But it sounds You're fun. getting it. I have twelve of them. A drift globe? Yes, yes. Seriously? Yeah, yeah it was a spell bag. that he launched. The Harlem Globe Drifters. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Daphne, good, you're my Daphne. favorite dude. <laughs> 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 right. Her little face got a little red too. That's just the flu. <laughs> yeah, in <sighs> his eggnog. Okay, um, I'm gonna need you to roll to get back up, though, and do um, strength. Cool, you get it. Um, nine. Oh, I'm not good at this. Um, all right, you fall again. You say it's slippery. <laughs> oh, no, it's slippery. Where, oh. where is still siren? But you haven't. You hadn't gone up that far yet, so okay. it's not like you. Can but it's get, like fall. You're not getting injured cool. on the way down. But it's like fall yeah. on my butt. Yeah, onto rocks. Under, ooh, yeah, oh, that kind of hurts, right? Uh, it wasn't that bad. You weren't that far up. Um, am I perceiving any of this, or am I still sleeping? Or no, she's quiet. She, you can't hear her. Okay, I'm stealthy. <laughs> First, I'm night. stealthy in my <laughs> inability to do anything. First note of the episode: Neath falls down the waterfall. <laughs> Can I? Uh, Second dies. note of the episode: Neath falls down the waterfall again. <laughs> Can I um? Can I like look back to see and see what's going on? Assassin. Well, for perception, she's not injured. So eleven. Oh well, um, you notice she's struggling. Hey, <laughs> hey, Keith, are you okay? <laughs> Her name is Neve. You don't hear this, Jelly. That was Daphne. <laughs> do, you, do you require assistance? You hear him. I kind of just look at him, <laughs> and I try climbing back up myself again. Why don't you toss her down a rope? I mean, I'm asking, you know, I don't want to be rude and assume. Just do it. I you don't have, know why I'm having such trouble. We I have tons be, of ropes. I should be like the guy from Princess Bride here. <laughs> it's slippery. All right, I tell you what, I grab the rope and I throw it at her. Oh, my God. Wow. <laughs> just the whole rope? Just the whole fucking <laughs> Here you go, dummy. Should have taken one of these. (laughs) I just watched a fall past me. The rope floats. He can use it to float. (laughs) Wait a. Well, we're down a rope. (laughs) We all have rope. I don't think we do. It comes in the explorer's pack. Everyone gets until we need three hundred feet of rope, and then we'll be in trouble. Then we're down fifty. Somebody grow their hair out. I'm growing wings at some point, so I don't. I don't foresee needing rope. That was my version of helping. <laughs> well, if she's giving you that, if she's giving you the stink eye, fuck her. You don't need to help her. No, he threw a, a, a coil of rope at me. Not you gave him 
the stink eye first. How did I give him the stink you eye first? You literally said, and I just glare at him like, <laughs> bitch, you get consequences. You gave him the RBF. <laughs> the I'm helping. Of, no, it's the RRF, the resting He's been making face. fun of me this whole <laughs> yes. time, so I was assuming he was just going to make fun of me He was trying to help. Again. He did. How am I supposed to know that? Use the <laughs> use the rope. <laughs> How am I supposed to use the rope? I'm going back up. Yeah, yeah, just do it that way. What? Throw it up. I'm not saying anything, actually. <laughs> I'm, she's not going to be able to throw it up. It's wet and heavy now. Okay, so <laughs> so I just all right, just cry. Yeah, cry and climb back up. I reckon for a strength. <laughs> it's wet and heavy. Twenty. You make it up. There you go. And you're sopping wet. So fuck. Just so you know, I just, I, I climb back up as well. You were anything. already up. I stopped playing around. <laughs> You've been up there. <laughs> you you just yelled at Keith. No, I thought I was still climbing. I look at Galsire and I go. <laughs> so now we're climb. There might be some treasure still left at the bottom of the waterfall. Oh, am I around here? Aren't you? Aren't you at like the I, you're at the here? top of the waterfall? Oh, I thought I never. Sorry, that's okay. Okay. Um. Hmm. And then I just stalk off. <laughs> a bit. I think it's really sweet though that you might start to be liking jelly a little bit. <laughs> I like jelly. Yeah. Jelly is my favorite. Yeah. yeah. It's really sweet. But how you, deep but you is want a minute the to see um river? I well at the waterfall or at the river? Going up east from Are you the swim waterfall. Up it? Oh wait. Going east. We were traveling west. Right. Now so I where want we go. came from? Yes. Um, it was just, you know, probably 20, 15, 20 feet there. Yeah. Okay. And not anything. There's nothing going on in the river except for what you guys <coughs> never ran into. We'll get to that later. Hmm. So. The, Anybody want to loot the waterfall? I would like to try to loot the waterfall. I'm going right. to go back and loot. <laughs> not if old Your turn is over. First. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh uh, gels, can you, um, m- how are you getting down there? Well, I have a spell called water walk prepared. Oh, she's just going to walk down. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Fucking more like stroll. How are you going to get down there? Well, I'm just going to use water walk. I'll like <laughs> so, and walk my way down there and not fall like an I idiot. I cast Jesus walk. <laughs> That's funny. I don't know how it's going to work on the waterfall, but I, I'm guessing. I that... fucking love it. I don't care. We're doing it. Okay. You're going to moonwalk. You're literally going to walk down horizontally. <laughs> Fun. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and cast it. And I've got an hour before my spell wears out so so you might even go you just walk right back up <laughs> yep, too don't you yeah <laughs> shit <laughs> i mean if worse comes to worse i could turn into a dolphin i could have just like <laughs> hung on to you or something like uh, i didn't see, know you Neith, were trouble. ask for help nope we're growing Neith. we're growing okay we're growing together we're growing together <laughs> i know that you're starting to like jelly a little but she won't she's not ready to admit it yet <laughs> no she probably won't ever but <laughs> Ever. The fact that she told you there's loot. Yeah, that, that means something. That does. Oh, she likes me. Yeah. <laughs> Jelly gets really jazzed that Neith talked to her. You're jumping up and down. <laughs> yeah. Okay. okay so. Um. Do you want to tell Rico about it? About the, the treasure? Re- Who's Rico? Well, she's still Hi. down at the bottom. Oh, yeah, yeah. right. Yeah. <laughs> you want to tell Pan? Well, where is he? He's at the top of the waterfall. Where you're at. Well, okay. I hey, thought she walked down a Oh, waterfall. no, I just kind of said we're doing it. We haven't done it yet. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I'm. Yeah. I'm down. I walk down the waterfall, and I'm okay. in the loot hole. <laughs> You're in the loot hole. Start rolling. All right. What am I rolling again? I don't remember. D100. You roll that funny one that has like twenty, eighty, seventy, whatever, and then and the your D10. D10. Mm-hmm. Hey, Pan. Oh, there's just, like loot down a... in the hole down behind that waterfall. <laughs> I just rolled a hundred. I'm not worried or about no, the loot. Zero. I guess you should go get so, some though. It's nice. fun. I'm gonna get something way better. I got a hundred thousand so, million things. Seven. 107, is that what you said? Well, I rolled the two zeros. That, so, that so that's a that's zero. That's 100, right? Okay, so seven. Oh. So that would be double zero, which is a zero, and then seven would be seven. Yeah, so it would always seven. So if it was zero, double zero, seven. Double seven, that's right. Yep. <laughs> if it was double zero and zero. So do I get like cool gadgets, like, I don't know, like it's watches it's that make me... Nail clippers. Oh, nail clippers that have like little like... Magic ones that never break. Ooh. That's their magic. I, I could use those. Yeah. <laughs> Jelly. <laughs> what do I get? Your weapon hits plus <gasps> two. What? Well, what is it? Like, what's the item? <laughs> Nothing. It just says that you get weapon plus two. 
So a weapon of your choice becomes a magic weapon and becomes a plus two weapon. Like forever? Yeah. Uh-huh. Forever. Oh, oh my gosh. All of a sudden a glow comes from one of your weapons. Whoa. Oh, that's sexy. Ooh. Sorry. <laughs> it's glowing red. <coughs> red for weed ass. Well, um, the only weapon I've really been using so far are my arrows. Bow. So you do your bow. That's it. Yeah. So yeah. I, yeah. Now have ma- I now have a magic bow. Yep. It's a plus two. So there oh on gosh. your bow, um, you would put bow and then plus two attack bonus or no it would just be yes you could essentially add it to your attack bonus but make sure the bow is the plus two not the attack bonus right it's fun because now it's a plus two bow which means it's a magic weapon so now you can hit ghosts and shit which ari can already do because he's got key empowered fists well i'd say that my water walk spell i get that next level okay roll one more time (laughs) oh soon though soon let's go kill some monsters for experience (laughs) What is the next? Can you look up what the next level is? I just rolled a ni- 99. All right. I mean, it's going to be a while up there. You know, because they, they increment. I'm mostly just harder. curious. That's cool. <gasps> Talisman of ultimate evil. <laughs> Whoa. I feel weird about taking this. But something tells me it's a object of great power. So 14,000. Yeah, we got a ways okay. to go. Yeah. What's it called? Talisman of Ultimate Let's go Evil. Fight yes. What does it look like? Monsters. Uh, a skull. Okay. It looks like a Ouija. So thing. I kind of take it, and I'm like, I'm like Ouija. So, yeah. You, so, so yeah, you have found a, a skull shaped talisman. You don't know that it's Ultimate Evil yet. So I kind of <clears> look <throat> at it a little bit. I'm a little bit like kind of weirded out. Like spooked. Huh. Yeah, like huh? Something tells me this is. There's something strange about this item, Ooh, but super spooks. I can't like I can't seem to resist it. Like I'm just like, oh, I don't know. I don't know about this, but I take it. Well, I you just, know we. I'm just can, cu- fuck it. It's a ring. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just too curious. I'm like, I can't just let this stay here. Okay. Uh, you walk back up the waterfall like you're God. I do? Okay. <laughs> Rick, you going? Nope. Okay. But I am going to need 10 minutes to pray. Okay. Um, That's cool. We need to pack up our camp and stuff anyway. Yeah. What time is it? Um, I suggest... Drinking the vials that you were giving, given, they're going to help you stay awake tonight. <coughs> what vials? The holy water vital, for the just holy water from the well. How do we know we should drink these? Get a feeling. Get a tingling. Well, let's say, let's say Daff or Jelly gets, um, yeah, I got it. Message on your beeper. What? <laughs> My beeper. Remember that little beeper thing that I gave you that you're going to get three messages on? At the very beginning. Oh, the receiver. The receiver. Yeah. Okay. I was like, well, it just friend. reminds me. I have the like, danger. Well, <laughs> like, right. like, well, either I'm needed in the yeah. ER or somebody wants drugs. <laughs> <laughs> ER. That's good. Also, the wee jazz is yeah. asking okay. Jelly for some drugs. So I, I hear it go, and I'm like, yeah, it sounds like a beeper. <laughs> <laughs> what does this say? I sell boobs. What? I sell boobs. <laughs> Dab, 10 extra XP for that. <laughs> really? Okay. Yeah, put it on there, bitch. Oh. Okay. Um, Our kids so will never know. It says they won't. <laughs> they won't. Um, it, uh, so on the on your beeper, it says, um, drink the drink the holy water. It'll help uh, help you stay awake tonight. Okay. I'm imagining like a magic eight ball sort of thing. Um, hey guys, so I just got a message from Weejazz on my beeper, <laughs> and it says we need to drink our holy water. It'll keep. It'll help us stay awake tonight. Did, do you do that? Did everybody? Yeah. Did it also? Did it also say, I sell boobs? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I was going to mention that, but yes, it did. I think Weejazz has a sense of humor. Um, I take out my vial, but I wait for everybody else and kind of to watch them. Do we? Do we have holy water? Yes, in we the half bag given, of holding. We were all given vials of holy water. Okay. okay well, yes. let's drink it. Let's drink I, up. I drink some Ooh, holy can we water. Cheers. Clinky. I'm not going to drink. I have 10 minutes of praying to do. I'll drink afterwards. He's still praying. So, um, Neith kind of just stands there with her holy water waiting until Panda drinks it out as well. But the praying is for a very, very good reason. You guys will soon see. Okay. Well, Panda's, I believe you. Panda's I'm just going to wait doing. for you to also <laughs> yeah, drink the holy water. Was, yeah. And make sure okay. you don't also keel All over. All right, Panda, it's been 10 minutes. <laughs> I pee on pain. All right. So after my 10 minutes of prayer to Bahamut finishes, um, <laughs> up materializes from the water coming out of the spraying water that's going over the waterfall, um, comes a beautiful blue translucent celestial griffin mount. 
Um, I'm casting Fine Steed. It's a level two paladin spell. Like we talked about it last session. You said I could have a griffin. And um, this is what? Yeah, this is paladin. It's just a level two paladin spell. Okay, so what are you doing here? Well, with a ten minute prayer, yeah, I can pray to whatever god. Um, I chose my god, and I can summon to me a steed. Um, it can be a celestial steed, an infernal steed, or a. Oh, you know what? I can't speak celestial. Yes, you can. No, I can't. I speak infernal. Since fucking when? Since always. always. Since character creation. <clears throat> so it's an infernal <laughs> griffin. Since character creation. For yeah, a since year. Since character creation. For a yeah. year. <laughs> um, and then it comes up out of the water. Um, all awesome looking. And it is now a griffin that come nuzzles up to me and puts his hand under my head. Um, and I pet it. And then I get up from my prayer. And I now have a griffin. That I can ride, um, and there's really, really cool things that I can do. I can communicate with it telepathically. Is this Griffin going to wow. follow us around everywhere we go? I'm going to ride it. <laughs> well, are we going to follow you? I, are, okay. Can it carry me in its mouth? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. I mean, I have to look up the stats for a Griffin, which what I'm going to do. What happens when we get to a town? Then I can unsummon it, and it vanishes. Okay. That's and then all I, I care about. pray 10 minutes again, but I mean... Why haven't you been doing this the whole well, time? Well, because I wasn't level five until a year and a half <laughs> later after you said character level creation. Level two paladin. Yeah, but I'm no, it's a level two paladin spell. But I didn't have level two spells until I was a level yeah, five I always, paladin. I forget yeah. that it yeah. was nine months. To be fair, yeah, <laughs> whatever. Um, so yes, so now I have a Griffin mount that is my steed that I will ride, and wow. it has an intelligent six. Um. If it's less than Intelligence 6, it's base Intelligence 6. I can communicate Welcome with it telepathically. Welcome to how I felt every time I DM'd. <clears throat> That's... Um, well, you know, better do some fishing, get him some fish or something. Well, it's, it's, he can probably do it. It's Yeah, I mean, it's it's super smart. And it has... I'm going to write its stats down for attacks and Have HP and things like that. Have you trunked your vial yet? Can you no, not yet. <laughs> um, I'm busy. All right. I just He's look, there. Are you going to have sex with it? No. Yes. Yeah. I look no. at the griffin in awe. I'm just like, whoa. Whoa. And, and like, then I will drink my stupid vial. Okay. Everyone's going to stay awake tonight. I right. wait Cheers. about 10 seconds. He hasn't killed over anything. I drink my vial. <laughs> okay. okay. I, I Neith, drink Neith already fell asleep. Out cold waiting on Pan. <laughs> so, Neith can't sleep. Neith is too cold from the fucking water. <laughs> And, the, and also wet and heavy. Um, wet and heavy. <laughs> Where's the monster manual? She should definitely build a fire. Didn't we have a monster manual? I own one. Yes, it should I be in one, one of the drawers. I I phone like pulled up. No, there's there's like one in one of the yeah, drawers. Yeah, I, I, I would like the physical book. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Joey turns into a Care Bear. Oh, that's a player's player. handbook. Where'd oh, my monster po- manual go? Is it in the box back there? We check. Oh, hold on, hold on. Oh, oh! There she blows. Okay. Monster manual. Thank you, Deborah. You're welcome. I actually own two. I just need the one. <laughs> People so got overly excited Griffin. at Christmas. Last I would year. like two. I need to look at two at the same time. Two monster manuals. <laughs> yes. Mm, gonna take my fist. <laughs> Show it. Okay, I'm going to summon so two monsters. Everybody, uh, everybody's together. Everyone just drank their holy water. Everybody feels a little bit like they Ooh. just rested all your spells. Is that like cocaine? Uh-huh. Nice. Co- yeah, we just, I mean, that's our favorite thing. <laughs> She's into it. Anyway, uh, what? I could do anything. Yeah, and I'd start talking really fast. Like, oh my gosh, I just feel like I get so much energy. What's happening? <sighs> <sighs> it's the cocaine. Oh. Yeah. Um, so everybody's there. Y'all feel better. Do your spells again. Everyone acts like they just rested. Um, Boom. I have 62 spells locked and loaded. Great. All right. Wait, drinking that potion refresh my spells? It did. Sweet. Summon another griffin. Another griffin. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fuck it. Army. No, I can't. I <clears throat> can only summon one. I can only have one summon at a time. Okay. So um, do you guys pick up camp? It's time to head west. I just leave everything forever. Um, All my toilet paper. So are we heading west? Away from the waterfall, correct? Yeah, I pack up. Yes, but you're still, you can follow the river. Um, I mean, the canoes were for something that didn't happen, so we don't really need them. (laughs) So um, you can ditch the canoes. I look around. How do we know we should ditch the canoes? 
I just I know. Like, how do you know? Right. I'm sorry. Like, yeah, no, that's, it's such a weird. These are line. good things. Well, no, that helps. Yeah, I'm right. so sorry. I feel really bad. It's just it. It for me as a character, it's just a weird line between meta gaming and it. Oh, it it it's helpful to to me. Yeah, I club the canoes to death. <laughs> like you could have like the canoes like float down over the waterfall and break apart in pieces. Um, and we I go, put oh, shit. I put the canoes <laughs> in my half bag of holding. Or Ari could put them in half half bag. There go ahead. Go. Do it. Two canoes, half it, bag of holding. Make half sure you put those down. We might want them later. Nope. Yep. I'm just. I just put them in the void and then cast them away. <laughs> down to the river of, of nothingness. All right. So everybody starts to head west. You're following a trail that is just along the side of the river. Um, and uh, fill up your canteens while you're here. We won't be with the river forever. And um. All of a sudden, um, I fill up my canteen. I fill up my canteen, or my water skin. Actually, I don't have it. A- I'm like, hmm, I have this strange feeling I should fill up my canteen. I then drink so. my canteen <laughs> and don't fill it back up. <laughs> <laughs> He's a camel. Okay, um, so all of a sudden, very quick, out of the blue, you see standing in front of you a nine and a half foot tall andro- androgynous um, wood elf. I seduce it. <laughs> what? Wow. Um, and no one, like he appeared. It was, it wasn't a, um, it wasn't a thing. He's got a braid that goes all the way down uh, to the floor. They, I should say they, because you don't know it's gender. Um, and he's wearing a dark brown uh, cloak, hooded. It's got these beautiful, um, really thin threaded silver lining it looks like it's armor but it's um it's very light it's like light in heaviness but it's very is this, strong is this thing awake yeah it just appeared in front of you it just appeared appeared he is standing there in front of you hey dude all right is that do you agree yeah it, what's hey what's what's that whoa where'd you come from He's just standing there, and he um, his hands are tucked in his in his arms, and he stares at you guys. And since you're the one that talked to him, he says, "Return what belongs to Helios." I put my hand um, near my. I put my hand onto my short bow. Return what belongs to Helios, and no harm will come to you. What belongs to Helios? What do we take that? Uh... Didn't belong to Weejess. Return what belongs to Helios. Oh, if you tell us what that is, maybe we can have a conversation, but... I try to very slowly and quietly load my short bow. Uh, roll for stealth. Ooh, sweet. You, um, you do it. It's uh, it's bigger than your modifier. Hold on, because I, I, I get my dex... You said I get a roll for stealth, so that's my deck. You made it. So yep. that's 18, so that is 24. Yep, you did it. Yay. So uh, I'm locked and loaded, right. and he doesn't know. He doesn't know. Oh. He's like, he has no idea. <laughs> no idea yeah. that you're fucking do ready. I, do I see it? <laughs> roll for perception. Uh, 19. Yeah. I see it, I'm just kind of like, <laughs> I'm like she's cool. She's, I, I think that's myself. Like, I don't so say that out he's, loud. He's talking to me, so I'm like, what are you talking about? Return what belongs to Helios, I mean, and you will not be harmed. What are whoa, you talking whoa. about? I mean, we got a lot of things. How do we know which one belongs to Helios? Yeah, so dude, then... I've got like a potion of super healing. Do you want that? <laughs> Is Helios into that shit? I have a magic lantern. <laughs> so then, what happens is um, also Cedric's here. He's always hanging out now. Right. He's here for life. If mm. if we didn't rem- say that, if oh, I didn't say Cedric, that um, the uh, what happens is the dude starts to um, surround you guys. He has manifested five of himself surrounding you guys. So now he has started to circle. So this is a he? You okay. guys. The, they. Okay. Since I already had my <laughs> bow loaded and already had it locked on him, does the one that I had it locked on move or change or anything no okay i let go of my bow my arrow Ooh. 
<laughs> right. You don't focus on our enemy. Like, that's true. That's true. Um, that that seemed like a threat to me. Okay, I am interested in what everybody else is doing first before I move on with that. Well, um, is the Griffin doing anything? I mean, it was already right. There. I wasn't playing in a fucking Griffin. <laughs> Does he get an attack? Two of them. <clears throat> You're gonna fuck this bitch up. Maybe. Yeah. Um, so when someone starts combat, do we roll initiative after that? Uh, you would let her resolve her attack because it's likely going to be a sneak attack, and then we would roll initiative. Yes, and I have sneak attack. Yeah, you're a rogue. So I get right. plus three you bonus. come with it naturally. <laughs> so you have to roll to hit to see if you hit him. Okay. Yeah, do that. Okay. You're using your bow? Yes. Yeah, it's going to be dex-based. Okay. Oh, sweet. Yes. Glad I picked my bow because that means... Since it's dexterity, that's 19 plus my sneak attack. 22. I'm sorry. It was six guys. Just a heads up. Okay. Well, 22. Oh, you you hit. All right. Roll for damage. You. Um, okay. 1d6. Oh, shit. He gets a whole one damage. <laughs> Don't you get X amount of d6s on a sneak attack? I feel like sneak oh, attack. Oh, 3d6. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Thank you. So seven... Oh, that one was on the corner. Eight. Eight there damage. You go. That's better. Yeah, sneak attack with a rogue is super beneficial. <clears throat> He's going to get us into a lot of combat. You don't just sit there and like start threatening me and then magic people appear. I <laughs> people, okay? Especially when we've already tried to talk to you. You already. come out of nowhere, you just start repeating yourself, and then more of you come. Okay. okay. All right. Um I need before we do um before we do an initiative, I need everyone to roll for perception. A ten. Six sixteen. I got a thirteen, my griffin got an eighteen. Sixteen. Okay. Everyone, um, well, um, initially you were supposed to, um, maybe someone didn't, couldn't tell who was the main guy, but everybody can tell who the main guy is. Did I hit the main guy? You did. So you're, you were already kind of locked on it. Like right. I, I was going nice. to let you have that. I appreciate that. Yeah. Thank you. I mean, your arrow's in him, so. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, fun thing about that. He um, literally just pulls the arrow out of himself. Oh, well, fuck you. Yeah. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. So I see him pull the arrow out of himself? Yes. Okay. Um, Vyashen. Butter butt. <laughs> or what did you say? Her? Beard butter. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> hold on, hold on. All right. Roll for initiative after Deborah figures out this thing. <laughs> By Miranda's rancid beard butter. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh yeah, because we're in combat, so I should I need dwarvish military phrases now. Uh, Sixteen. My Griffin got a twenty. I got a fifteen. Ari, initiative six. Oh, do I still need a roll for initiative? Even though yeah. no, I'm you're first? I'm putting you on first. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. To me. All right, so it's Deborah Griffin, Reek, or goddamn Pan, uh, Jelly, and Ari. All right, so I guess it's the Griffin's turn. My Griffin goes first. I what about what about first. the what about the wood elf? She goes. She yeah, I just went. went. Oh, okay. Well, oh, then. the wood elf. He goes dead last. <laughs> oh, yeah, wow, if he makes it. <laughs> <laughs> um, my Griffin is going to charge up to him and snap at him with his um, beak. Sure. Do we have to roll for perception each time we attack to make sure we're attacking the right guy? Oh, once oh. you know, you're once we were able, yeah, probably yeah. once we were able to perceive to the real one, probably right. saved us. Right. He's bleeding a little bit. Oh, well, that so makes you can feel tell better. on his cloak. Okay. But he pulled the fucking air. Jeez, this guy's a jerk. <laughs> I mean, we tried to talk yeah. to him, you know. Hey, that's what I you mean... get when you fuck when your god is Helios. <laughs> in my in my world, not in real world. Griffin got a okay. twenty two to hit. Okay, sorry. What's wow. does this thing have a constitution modifier? Because it's gonna need it. Because it's gonna need it. Yeah. <laughs> it now has a plus six modifier. <laughs> now that she knows. <clears throat> I'm done walking. Nothing. Walking is peasant bullshit. <laughs> You're like, walking is peasant. I'm done walking. Walking's for fucking plebs. Oh. All right. So Welcome that, to the, being the DM. That elf is going to... <laughs> right. Elf, that These elf are is your probably going to die. Yeah. That's, I mean, I hope so. <laughs> That's the point. He's not getting your parcel. Okay. I mean, I'm also going to give it to him. <laughs> <laughs> it. And he stopped right in front of us, right? 
like appeared right in front of us? Yes. Okay, so I don't have to move to attack him. So I get no. I get he my is extra uh, within range. Bam. bam. <clears throat> what do you call it when it's hand? To, oh, hand to hand. Hand to hand. Melee. Melee. Yep. Melee. This guy's name is fucked. <laughs> 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 okay. Specifically, I I did forget to tell you he's they, they are also um a diva it's a celestial type of elf so he's like you know from helios just i don't know if that that's cool makes you guys that's he still cool. bleeds I'm he sorry. still bleeds i'm sorry bleeding. i'm sorry they still bleed that's right they made multiples <laughs> of themselves <laughs> that were surrounding yeah, me it's another they literally did. they <laughs> okay um so uh Griffin rolls a 22. 22 to hit, yep. Uh, you definitely hit. Sweet. Takes uh, six damage from the beak. <clears throat> and then the griffin rears up and swipes down at him with his claws. It has multi-attack. It attacks with beak and then claws. Um, 21 to hit. Yep. Damn. 15 plus six. And then 2d6 plus four. That's so some good damage. Six damage. 10, 14 damage. From the griffin. Total? Yeah. Or okay. on the claws. Wait. It hit with its beak first. Right. Okay, gotcha. So twenty it was a minus of twenty. Yeah, it just got hit hard. All right. Um Pan. Oh sweet. Then um I charge toward him and swing my warhammer <clears throat> back um behind me and then swing it forward towards this elf. Roll to hit. It's gonna be sorry you missed with us. Seventeen? Yeah. 17 hits? Nice. Yes. Wait. Is it? Yes, it does. I just remembered some things. Okay. Then he takes eight damage from the Warhammer. And I get an extra attack as a level five paladin. <laughs> I get an extra attack. Jesus. Oh, it's poor elf. I need to make this a little harder. <laughs> poor elf fucker's evil. Um, that was a 20. That was a crit. Nat 20. Nat 20? <laughs> yep. How much damage are you doing? Uh, seven... And 13. 13 more damage. Jesus. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, this is a lesson for Jenna <laughs> in making monsters a little bit more crazy. That's my turn. And then I put my arms out um, like to my side and I roar at him. Like, you you like try Bahamut to make monsters would. more crazy and you guys still mess up stuff. Like m bring out crazy <laughs> stuff. So good luck. That's what it seems like. And my roar yeah. is kind of like me emulating Bahamut. It's a roar of justice. <laughs> nice. You actually get five extra experience for doing that. Nice. Yeah. Because it was hot <laughs> and very pan. I do tend to roar at people a lot. That's how intimidated the Zelda It's my, yeah, it's, <laughs> it's my, my intimidation factor, just trying to let them know um, you were fucking with a paladin Bahamut today is not a good day for you. <laughs> uh, gels. Yeah, that's or no, it's pan. No, or I just no, went. gels. It's jelly. Um, okay, well. Is this thing red <laughs> yet? <laughs> About to be probably, probably close. <laughs> is to she it. grizzlying out. I'm we'll like, see. Hey, where's your god now? Where's Helios now? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you can go. Oh, you can. Wow. About to send you back to Helios, and you can tell him that he's a jerk, and you are too. <laughs> Call lightning. <laughs> so I cast. I'm using a new spell called Call Lightning. And it sounds like something Matt made up. <laughs> <laughs> I guess Call Lightning. I, I was cast. just about to cast that. <laughs> And just like, just to kind of look cool and feel cool, I hold my fists up in the air while I say it. <laughs> like, I love the spell. rogue is having so much influence on Jerry. <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. <laughs> you guys are going to be so, best friends. Um, <laughs> so for our viewers and listeners, it's, uh, Cloud Lightning, it's um, a storm cloud appears in the shape of a cylinder. It's 10 feet tall, 60 foot radius. Centered on a point, you can see 100 feet directly above you. So Wait. basically, there's I'm mean, somebody in a cloud directly, a hundred feet directly above him, or them. I'm sorry. Okay. And yeah. then, um, they. And yeah. then, when I cast a spell, I can choose a point, and the ch the point I'm choosing is the jerk elf, and a mm -hmm. bolt of lightning flashes down from the cloud to that point. The main jerk elf, right? Right. Yeah. The one that's bleeding. Yeah, this looks familiar. I also call lightning down from the sky. Where'd it go? Cool. <laughs> um, and then the creature. So they have to make a dexterity saving throw. It's going to be versus your spell save. Is that... Uh, so that'll be uh, 13. 
So it needs to beat a 13. If it does beat a 13, it's going to take half damage. If it does not beat a 13, it is yeah, taking all of the damage. Yeah. It's- I think I did read I get the advantage on it, though, if I'm 13 or more. Well, that's fine. You're the yeah. DM. Yeah. yeah whatever you- it's your world. We're just living in it. And I did not roll well, so <laughs> oh, oh, bad DM. day. <laughs> it was like me, like every roll, like I have the worst. Card. So, uh, yeah, roll for damage. <laughs> well, um, basically, this is three d ten lightning damage on a failed save. Fucking a. <laughs> Get it, champ. Jesus Christ. <laughs> We roll with badasses. <laughs> yes. So three, so eight, so four. eight in the microphone. I'm sorry, 14. 14 lightning damage. Oh, I thought it was going to be more than that. All right. He's Finish it off with your one punch man punch. <laughs> <laughs> Ari walks up to him and flicks him in the dick. He dies <laughs> horribly and atrociously in sick um, convulsions. Can I perceive how like hurt this elf is? No. Damn. <laughs> On a scale of one Because he's X. not showing it. Uh, Not because of your perception. I mean, I would really like to see if we could get some information. Hey, guys, should we try to get some information out of him? No, I don't okay. care. <laughs> I mean, we, yeah, he could be. He's only going to tell you that he he came for one thing. Well, he, I he's not going to tell you anything. Well. Yeah, I think I, that's all he said. He said all right, I'm an assassin. I'm going to get an information out of people. I strike at him with my short, short he sword. Did, he's not a, a pain feeler, though. I think that's clear. I he's got still other standing. Ways of getting okay, what's not Ari's, pain? What's, not torture? Let's see what Ari's doing. doing. I strike at him with my short, short sword, and spend a key point to cat to use stunning strike. Nice. If I can hit him, you do what? I swing uh, a sword. What's short stunning sword. strike? I can't remember. It's um, you have to. He has to. Uh, it has to um, make a Constitution saving throw, um, or be stunned until the end of my next turn. Oh, so everybody else Whoa, will get to go again. Oh shit, wow. that is cool. Before, and I'll get to go again as well. Yeah, I'm gonna get to go a lot though, because I got like extra attack. And- <laughs> yep. You are up Bonus to what actions. four or five attacks right now? <clears throat> At least four. At least four, because you could spend a key to attack again. Yeah, and I get a bonus action. And you get a bonus armored, action. Yep. Attack. And then you have extra attack, which I you could, could then spend a key to get another attack. You're looking at five attacks. I could spend to get flurry of blows as well. <laughs> Just burn through key. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Anyway, yeah. I yeah roll. Oh, that's like uh, twenty two. <laughs> All right, yeah, um, you definitely hit. Then. You can go either way. Okay, now you got to roll. Like to oh, I already sure. did. Uh, fifteen. I did. You got to beat a fifteen. Oh, I did. I got twenty. Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> no, you're not stunned. <laughs> <laughs> but I, uh, I guess I still do damage though. Right. Yep. You would still do your your damage with damn. Your sword. I two. really kind of was hoping that because that was two. That's a cool well, spell. Well, it's worth a shot. Yeah. yeah. Uh, two damage. The number? Uh, yes. T-W-O? And then I take bonus action of an unarmed attack. I punch you. Punch him. <coughs> How many key points are you up to now? Five. Nice. Uh, eleven. Damage? No, do I hit with eleven? Oh, yes. Oh, okay. oh wait. No, wait, you, don't. <laughs> I was, no you don't. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's My okay, brain was hurt. No, a, you don't. Like negative armor? <laughs> I spend a key point to use extra attack. Okay. And a... Uh, uh, you don't have to spend a key to use extra attack, unless you're using the key extra attack. I think I have to spend a key. Didn't you, at level five, didn't you just get an extra attack in yes. general? I don't think so. Well, I did. Where are we at on time? Time for you to not worry about it. <laughs> can't hurt me anymore, Deborah. <laughs> I'm not afraid of you. Oh, no, I can't I just attack. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, just get an extra attack. You guys got attack. snarky, you, man. you can spend a key to get an additional attack, chair. but you already now come based with an chair. extra attack. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm in the seat that you were in before. Yeah. yeah. It's snarky. <laughs> okay, so I attack again. And with my short sword, and also spend a key point to cast Stunning to use Stunning Strike again. At level five, he gets extra attack. Oh, he can spend well, yes, key no, that's cool. To get a but bonus you can, attack, so you but... can do Stun again. Yes, yeah, that, he, as many cool. times as he's got that's, key, yeah. as many attacks that. as he that's got. That's cool. Uh, Thirteen to hit, and I have to do Constitution saving on that still. It's thirteen to hit. No, oh, then you no. don't hit. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> um, I take my bonus action of punch. 
<coughs> five. Yeah. Can't you spin a key to attack again? He Probably, but it's not going well. The elf. <laughs> <laughs> the elf looks at you and smirks. I am. Um, I jump back. <laughs> you should have just flicked him in the testicles. Would have been a guaranteed kill. I'll let you guys soften him up some more. <laughs> okay. It is Apparently Jelly's I'm just going to run out of key trying to hit this thing. My turn. No, it's not. That can't be right. It's no, his turn. It's, it's got to be. Yeah. I just read it's wrong. their turn. I am wrong. It's turn. It's its turn. The elf's turn. <laughs> it's the elf's turn. Okay. Uh, it's. Um. He uh, X I T S zits disrobes. <laughs> he takes his robe off to reveal giant angel wings. Oh, we're leveling up. Go angel next. wings. Um, he still has blood. He there is blood all over him, though he cannot feel pain. So and I just like we wincing, just know that limping or like no. showing any signs. Okay. Like you're noticing that he's Except, taken a lot of damage oh, and he's, he's not he's affected. He, oh, guys, he's not real. <laughs> he's <laughs> we bleeding. Can just, we he's can bleeding. just walk away. He just doesn't just have the sensation of pain. He's a fucking angel, angel elf demon oh, thing. Uh, diva, a diva actually, which is a cool name I think for this angel. It's a Jumanji. Um. So then he also um appears in in one of his hands as a bow staff and then he is going to attack pan first <laughs> welcome to being the dm he Bring is it, motherfucker. he is going to he's yeah. only going to be attacking me from here on out if i can pass this compelled duel <laughs> so he um he swings his bow staff at you and What's your armor class? 20. He hits. Nice. Wow. You're dead. I'm sorry. I meant I to stun him. I highly doubt it. it. And what's my... What, Same as the weapon damage. I don't know what's the oh, damage yes, of a bow Oh, yes, it is the bow staff. It is. Yeah. Five damage. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> I only have 30 <laughs> left. Oh. No, I have 44 left. Oh, nice. I have 49 HP base. Cool. You aren't, haven't even broken in my land hands. Pool. I know. I'm good. I'm good. I am super good until I get below 24. I um, I cast Live Forever on myself. <laughs> Got it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Maybe that's the potion of immortality coming up. We'll see. Whoa. Yeah. No, I make shit up. It's Does he fun. have any other attacks or just the one? Uh, Yeah. He gets um five extra attacks because he's got five people surrounding oh, him. Fuck him. Let's go. Uh, so... <laughs> I like our odds. There are five of us. However, they only do. Uh, They're five. Oh, the Griffin. The Griffin. The 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 five little cr- clones can only do the same swing with their bow staff. Correct. Not at the same time as the elf. It's like an afterthought. So um, they collectively swing at uh, Neath first, and oh, all five go at one person. Ooh, you never mind. It didn't matter. Well, actually, they, they. What's your armor class? Sixteen. Yeah, they definitely hit you. Fuck. Um, <laughs> Sorry, Neath. I tried three to damage, stun it. Neith. <laughs> three damage. That's not bad. No. Nothing. So they don't no. hit very hard. For an angel of Helios, these are <laughs> pretty bitch. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I thought that thought this I was. A, I thought this was actually gonna be a little <laughs> this is harder. A cool, this I didn't, is a cool villain. I'm actually. Yeah. Doing I'm. This. Yeah. It's a little D and D. It's a little Jetta. So I'm but about to kill it. I I really thought this was gonna like. <laughs> no, nothing. Goes I thought as... you guys were gonna have trubs. Nothing well, goes you didn't as anticipate thing. me summoning an infernal Griffin. <laughs> I did not. Yeah. No, no. Um. Uh. All right. So it is uh Neith. My Neith's turn. turn. Uh, um. Well, since you have a little see... bit of a knock on your head, just a heads up. Okay. Well, since it seems like there. are close enough to hit me with a staff they are um i pull out my short sword why don't you have a rapier i'll do that i forgot so she pulls out her rapier. i'm not used (laughs) to having a rapier it was given to you last game by the i know but i'm just not you know instinct takes over i'm just not used to pulling it out at least we got so i start to pull out my short sword but then pull out my rapier you're like wait what you what you um which is a finesse and i know which one is the correct one right um 
It is a finesse weapon. So you can use your dex? Sweet. Yeah, it's hot. Did you say your dex is like plus eight Her dex is plus, plus four. Because she's, nice. she's a dex-based character, so she's yes. probably got an 18 Now, dex. if you let me use acrobatic or acrobatics or athletics, I can then times that to eight. You no, uh, not, not here. Or I can't do that with tech. Attack. Actually, yeah. no, not right now, because no, you I are can't. still used to using this. So this okay. there's going to be a That's little fair. bit of... Okay, so I pull out my rapier, and I go to pierce the... The guy. Okay, roll for hit, or roll to hit. On guard. 17. Is that with your dex modifier? Yes. Um, What's the armor class of the angel? Sweet. I was about to say, I hit on a 17 earlier. Um, I gotta find my 8. Here it is. Uh, 4. I mean, I hit him. That's all that matters. (gasps) You have a multicolored pen. Is that for like a multicolored universe? It was initially to help me organize things, but I never do it how I planned. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> I hurt you so much. Oh, you know what they say, <laughs> the best laid plans of mice and men. All right. It and is, DMs. Um, it is Griffin uh, boy. the Griffin's turn. Griffin boy, the chonky Griffin boy. <laughs> 17. You hit? The Griffin chomps at him again with his beak, trying to... You want to do damage first? Well, that's that was the attack. I hit and oh, I was, gotcha. I was, I was gotcha. That describing the attack. That was your second attack. action. Got no, it. no. Initial action. Uh, D8 for five damage. Hell yeah. And then um, it rakes at him with both of his claws. <sighs> like chonky griffin boy. He is covered in uh, like griffin scratches. 20, 23 to hit. I have 22 hits. I know 23 I mean, you hits. definitely hit. Yeah. And that's 2d6 plus four. Just oh. think, if you can turn into mythical creatures, you now will have access to a griffin. Five, Can ten. Can you turn into mythical, too? Four, okay. Fourteen damage. Nice, bitch. Oh, you made him look like a bitch. My griffin is a, <laughs> my griffin is a big, chonky boy. I love him. I'm going to give him a name and everything. That was my griffin's turn. And then my griffin screeches at him loudly. You do a roar again? I don't. My okay. griffin does. Gotcha. My I will roar. My griffin screeches. Um, okay, it is uh, Pan's turn. Pan's turn. <clears throat> Player's handbook. I need to know if compelled duel is an um, an extra action or if it's a standard action. I should have it memorized. You're right. Well, it only matters now because now I get an extra attack. <clears throat> so I think it's an extra action. I'm pretty sure it's an extra action. Oh, whereas before, like you just It's a bonus line, action. Yeah. yeah, so it's a bonus action. Okay, so I will... Um, point my warhammer at the angel and then tell him by the power of bahamut i compel you to stand and fight me and i cast compel duel um it needs to beat my spell save dc of 15 so it's a it does not all right so now uh, he can beat. no longer move away from me in fact it, all the elves are they compelled? aren't correct nice so they can that was no how longer, low I rolled. <laughs> they can no longer move away from me in, until they pass a willpower save. Um, if they attack anybody other than me, they are disadvantaged, which means they roll twice and take the lowest of the two. Um, that's it. You're, I, I'm not going to remember that. You'll have to I'll, I'll remind okay. you. Okay. Yep. <laughs> okay. Um, and then... Um, yeah, you get extra attacks, right? I have two attacks. And then I'm going to, after I compel him to duel me, I'm going to twirl my warhammer up in the air and bring it down diagonal across... T- Chest or head area. See if I hit. Better hit. No, I can't. Called shot. 12, I miss. No, you miss. Second attack. It just swings. He does a little matrix bend out of the way. <laughs> 17. Of the, of the 17 hammer. does hit. Nice. 17 to hit. 17 hits, yes. And that's a D8. Six more damage. Hell yeah, buddy. <laughs> and that's what, it for what? my turn. Get it, get it. That's the way we like to beep. <laughs> I hurt you. Thank you. <laughs> you make done. this a blast, Deborah. You do. Me and Dapper yeah. talking about that. Like, is that water? Always in that looks divine. Yeah. I might get like, me a big so old glass of ice me. water. At Thank the you. Yeah. Okay, yeah. good. I love it. Hopefully we'll kill this thing soon. I so kind of wish break. I could just be DM forever. I don't. I'm just not good at playing. I think I'm good DM, though. You are a great DM. Yeah, I just I'm want you to good. know. I had low Thanks, expectations. Man. And you, <laughs> you blew them out of the water. You're fantastic. Yeah. I love your game. He's like, Deborah, you're okay. Thanks. They just like me for my experience. That's <laughs> it, really. Okay. It is... You only did the... You, we that was it. Yeah, my damages. turn's done. Okay. Uh, Jelly. 
Okay. Um, Fuck him up. Yeah, I'm just going to shoot an arrow at him. Yeah, might as well. You know, just yeah, good old fashioned, good old fashioned arrows. Especially since your bow Magic. is plus two. Yep, exactly. So you get to add your dex to hit, and then when you do damage, you do your base damage plus two. Are you proficient with the bow? Yes. Should be. She's a druid. She's been, so she been using bonus. it the whole time. If the if the DM says we can use our proficiency bonus, I mean that's oh absolutely how it's written. always yeah. I th- I assumed you already were. Mm-hmm. If you're proficient Should. in the weapon, you get to add your proficiency bonus. Um. Well. Also, Ooh. I would like. To see you uh, cock your bow or load your bow. Okay. Well, okay. That's what I do. As you do it, the end of the the arrow the is on fire. Whoa. Yes. Cool. <laughs> um, I'm like, and I say, this is how we do things downtown. <laughs> oh shit! Is that the fire thing? This is how we do things beyond the mist, bitch. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Holy shit! You actually printed out the episode list. Damn. Yes. That was a good one. Um, uh, I just rolled a nat 20. Oh, all right. You so definitely then, uh, hit that bitch. You will all do right. your damage dice twice. 1d6. So you will roll 2d6. So 2d6 now. And then you will add plus 4 because it's 1d6 plus 2 because it's a plus 2 bow. Then right. 1d6 plus 2. So your 2d6 plus 4. Cool. Uh, uh, 3. Excuse me. The plus, yeah. 5, 8, eight 12. 8 plus 4 is 12. Nice. That is a good hit with a bow. Can that I ask you, really nice um, do me a favor it's and dead. roll for, um, let's make it. Is it more damage to the bow than it is lightning strike? <laughs> <laughs> magic <laughs> magic bows, a plus two yeah, bow that is dope. Pretty, that's pretty BA. Roll, uh, roll for dexterity, please. Mm, okay. You hit it. <laughs> or you do, you do it right. An eight? Yeah. Yeah, you beat wow. me. Wow. Okay. Um, okay, so. Did you roll low? The, yeah. The arrow, uh pierces the uh one of the wings what? and he screams dude and do feathers rip out and just start to fly all over yeah about? there's it's yeah. just starting uh, so you do feel pain <laughs> that's okay. good to know all right uh, oh shit no that's not what it was that uh too bad and he get i'm gonna give him an or uh, two extra damage points for it being if you hit the wings two extra Ooh, damage okay and i kind of taunted a little bit i'm like Oh, uh, too bad he can't fly back to Helios. I clipped that on your <laughs> ass. <laughs> yeah, five extra points. Oh, okay. da- XP. Five points for You're going to get like so much extra XP. Just for being funny. So much fun. Well, she d- really is the one that like holds this whole podcast together. Mm, it may- We all do. <laughs> I'd like to thank the uh, She's editors. also a team player. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I do, Jelly is getting a lot of confidence. She's starting to really kind of. Yeah, Neith is rubbing off on you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're just so inspired. Like, I just want to be a cool girl. <laughs> yeah. That's all I've ever wanted. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I think Ari, I'm still you're up. dropping. All right. So, I like, use the short wet. sword again and uh, strike at. We didn't, you didn't successfully compel duel. Yes, you did. Yeah, I did. They are all focused on you. Yeah, Got it. I did yeah, successfully so compel duel those That's motherfuckers. Right. I take the short all sword and go to of them. strike at it. Okay, roll for, roll to hit. Do you need a 17 or better? Uh, so will be you with your, your proficiency. Dice. Yes, so it's uh, 21. There's yeah, a, there's a hit. It. There's me, a hit, Let champ. me get a... And so what did you, your short sword, did you stab him in a particular strike, spot? Uh, striking across his body. Striking it's across body, his body. Sorry. Okay. It's body, uh, sorry. Okay. That's a two damage, and uh, also you'll need to make the constitution saving row. Okay. It's a two stunning strike. It, constitu- okay, got it. 11. So you are stunned until the end of my next turn. That's Does all. that cancel... It no longer gets to attack. I can't attack no, at you're all. you're stunned. No, uh, and... Uh, do me a favor, roll for when the apparitions are charisma. Probably... Roll for charisma. Oh. Ari mounts it and fucks it. Yeah, six. <laughs> um it only works on the big elf. Or on the main elf. The other ones are still compelled to duel. Ooh. Pan. Okay. And I uh use my bonus action of a punch. Seventeen. You hit. Three damage. I um then get an extra attack. Yep. Yeah, monks get retarded really quick. They're dope. They're my second favorite class. And that's what the short sword. Oh, but no, I ate. Uh, so I spend a key point to do flurry of blows. <coughs> and I, like a. And I, yeah, I punch. Cool. A, I punch again. 
Yeah, 19. You hit. Um, a bunch. Three damage, and then I punch again. Actually, do your last no, one. one I work. think that you should, since it was a flurry, I think you should roll the damage twice. I would do that. Yeah, give him the old RE1, too. Two. Two. Okay, so that was five total then? Okay. I think that was 10 total. Okay. Short sword, punch, punch. Okay. Um, he is... Stunned as fuck. Uh, very stunned. He actually looks kind of, um, what is it called when you are? Horny. <laughs> His dick is out. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Um, I pee on it. have one. Um, so. It doesn't have it one. It doesn't Jenna, have Jesus one. Christ, they, it's 2020. They, is it? When Almost. Oh, 2019. It. <laughs> okay. So, um, uh, he is, uh, We're in the future petrified. Right He's petrified was what I was looking for. And he just kind of falls over. He's still alive, but he's stoic. So he lands kind of just on the ground and it makes like a plume of dirt flies around him. Um, I get the and he cannot out. do he can't do anything. He's he's fucked up and stunned. I take my broom out of my hat bag of holding and sweep up all that. <laughs> <laughs> dust bin too. <laughs> yeah. Extra five points for creativity. Put it on there. Five points for Gryffindor. Um, <laughs> hey guys, I think we should probably try to talk to him or something. No, fuck no, that. no, he's not. No, don't. Okay. Do that. Yes, his talking is return. Return but you took helium, right? Okay, yeah. I guess that's all he can say. Yeah, <laughs> we gotta kill this thing quick. He doesn't care about dying. Like he doesn't really feel that much pain. So whose turn is it? Okay, it is uh, the elves the that are clones. face or that are they're About all focused I on get pan. No <laughs> and um, how long is Kimpel duel last? Is it the whole one thing? minute? One minute. And so it's only been one turn, so that's you're going to be doing it forever. Okay, um, so they yeah, all at six turns at least. What's your armor class again? 20. Never mind. Fifty. Uh, <laughs> Retarded. They, that's what right. It is. They. <laughs> Mine's forty. They all swing their bow staff, um, but for some reason they can't hang on to it, <laughs> so it flies, um, in the uh, it fly they all five. Bell staffs fly into the river. Tell me. <laughs> you know, as DM, if you actually want something to happen, you don't have to roll for it. Okay. Just like, you know, I just making sure it's you just, know. It's just fun for me. No, it is. <laughs> I used to do it all the time, even it's though the just dice fun. sucked. Yeah. It's fun. Plus, I kind of like that it makes it a little more. You're fucking disgusting. That's a great idea. To put the lime arena in the eggnog? <laughs> Why not? Gangster now it's move. lime eggnog. <laughs> That's a bold move. Fuck life. <laughs> that was Daphne is living life over life. there right now. Daphne yeah. is turned into jelly. <laughs> yeah, it yeah. was initially the, the other way around. I'm living my best life. Okay, so you have disarmed accidentally all the elves. Uh, accidentally. Yeah. Um, so, and that was their turn. So my now, God is an awesome God. He uh, reigns. Neat. <laughs> I feel really weird about stabbing something just lying on the ground. Well, then do That's nothing. really pussy of an assassin to say But so. you know what? No, so what I'm going to do is instead of taking my rapier out, I'm going to take my two daggers out and slash, slash. Where out on the body? Um, on its wings. My goal is to yeah. like try to slash one off all the way. <laughs> I, I said I feel weird about it. I didn't say I wasn't going to do anything. Oh, no, I'm saying, no, that's what I get I feel wanted. weird and butcher it at the same time. <laughs> that's what I wanted. Roll to hit. Um, so. Or roll to slash. Um, I rolled a 17. Do I get anything? Do I get any pluses? Uh, checking, no, but you got 17 I'm checking hits. now because he's prone. I'm seeing if there's any... An attack roll against creatures have advantage, so you can roll twice and take the highest of the roll. But if you succeeded on your first one, yeah. I'm fine. Okay. Yeah, so you did. Uh, I hit his wings. Okay. I go to slash off what my daggers. He He's petrified. He can't do anything, okay. but he, except for he's not able to open his mouth. You, all you hear is... <laughs> attack rolls against this creature have advantage. That's what I just said. Oh, I wasn't listening. Uh, four damage. <laughs> four damage. Uh, we're gonna uh, roll one more time since we've got since it's the wings. Oh, see. And add it. Six damage total. Yes. Okay. I think we're all gonna hit this thing now. Okay. Which is mostly aimed at myself. 
<laughs> um, and the wings, one you got a whole wing off. The damn thing. You got one whole wing off. It's butchering this the motherfucker up. is screaming with his mouth closed oh. hard. Just ah! <laughs> something in elvish celestial shit. Um, screaming it with his mouth shut. All right, kill it. All right, it is Griffin. You kill up, it, pal? Griffin. I bet he do. Fin- well, maybe not. Finish. All right, so um. My griffin being intelligent sees the reaction from the attacking of the wings, so my griffin goes to tear at the at the wings with its beak for its first attack. Okay. Roll the bite. Um eighteen plus four is twenty two. I'm not even yep. gonna bother re rolling that. Uh roll your uh what's your what's his dice? damage from yeah. a, uh the beak is a D eight plus four. Okay, and then roll it twice. Three six ten damage. All right. And then it's going to furiously claw at the one wing that's still attached. All of a sudden, everybody hears the other uh, elf angels also screaming. That was a base 17 on the die. It hits. I'm turned on by their screams. And yeah, you hit. this is uh, 2d6 plus 4. There's 5. There's 11. He's dead. Uh, plus, oh, four, 15 damage. <laughs> you didn't even get all the way done. He's dead. I'm like, oh, what's that you wanted, to re- wanted us to return to Helios? We are way over, but we should loot the body. <laughs> so, well, we've got, we've still got five other elves. So They didn't do. disappear when he died? No, no, oh, they did not. Okay. Oh, what the I know, God. you kill the mothership most of the and time. And then my griffin lets out a um, celebratory squeal or roar. Oh, yes. And then it's going to start like, Eating at the rib cage. And <laughs> oh no! This is angel. this is probably it. the best meal he's gonna. It's pretty lean though. Just poke like, it. He's very, very very lean. Back up. Very very lean. I'm right, if I'm right there, close enough to have hit him with chopped off a wing with daggers, I'm pretty close. So I just start letting him have with, at it. What the griffin do? I'm just yeah. gonna let my griffin eat whatever it kills. Like, just poke its eyes it out. Kills, like a vulture, it, it keeps what like... it kills. So. um Cedric actually flies down from oh. he's been and perched. also starts eating him. He's yes, and <laughs> Apex both pressures. of them. <laughs> we both, talked about this. Both of them can't trust them. They're raptors. Grab um, a couple of feathers from the angel wings and stuff them in their wings. That's Ooh, what I was hoping was cool. they were. I was hoping they were going to take some trophies. Yeah. Griffins Whoa. are very proud. He would yeah. probably keep a trophy. I thought he would too. Yeah. Um, okay, so that's what he does. And actually, did the Cedric Griffin, take some? The, yeah. the, the what Griffin, the Griffin, Cedric do. He's gifting it. I'm going to say he's gifting <laughs> it. This is a sign between the Griffin and These Cedric. Are fucking that raptor, you can't together. trust them. <laughs> We talked about this. You can trust raptors. Like I've taken one. Like I brought this motherfucker down or helped in any way no, whatsoever. It's a bit, it's a friendship badge. It's a it's a good gesture to so the, the other familiar. shadow clones are still there. The five shadow clones are still there, and they still have some damage. They do not have. Uh, they are screaming. They do not have. I'm cut you gesturing. Um, they do not have their bow staffs, and uh, as soon. <sighs> Let's say Tuesday. 10 seconds into him being dead, you see like just a plasmatic thing leave his body. Nice. And then go into the other five. Oh, rock on. So okay. it like splits apart. There can only be one. I was about to say it's quick, <laughs> quickening style, yeah. Um, and uh, however, they don't disrobe or show any wings. So they're just standing there. Uh, <laughs> without a weapon. Uh, so, <laughs> um, whose turn is it? Pan's turn. Pan. Pan's Everyone's turn. turn. Free for all. Oh, and they are all still focused on Pan. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know. All right. Well, I'm going to. Oh, no. I didn't give them their turn. Oh, yeah. That's right. That's right. Okay. So they're focused on you. Was his turn. No, you did because they missed and dropped their weapons. We were at the start of the new order. Because she attacked That wasn't him. last session? Mm-mm. That was okay, last got turn. Got oh, then yeah. she went, and then my griffin went, and so it's my turn. They were disarmed last turn. Okay. Right. Yep. Then we're good. Okay. So then I turn around, and I roar at them that they're next, and then I just swing at the first one closest to me. That's awesome. Oh, that's a one. <laughs> <laughs> the, you the got number. overconfident. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> one of them just laughs at you. That's well, all right, because I get an extra attack. Yeah, keep so going. So I quickly recover, and then I swing my hammer um, across my body. 
back at the one that's laughing at me. <laughs> see how see if he thinks it's this funny. Uh, there's a 19. Uh, <laughs> that hits. 22. <laughs> he didn't think it was that funny. I really like how <sighs> Pan doesn't really roll in the middle. It's either all or nothing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> right. Well, that's because he trains his dice. Yeah. Uh, for three damage. So I clonk him for three damage right in his stupid laughing mouth. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, it looks, it appears that collectively they're all wounded from it. Oh, nice. <laughs> okay. Still um, attacking Pan or focusing on Pan. So it is Jelly's turn. Um, I'm going to shoot an arrow at the same elf that Panda's hit. Okay. So. SC bass. I can't believe I whiffed on my first attack. That's terrible. <laughs> Welcome to my world. That's, yeah. that's what happens when you get cocky, right? Yeah, that's exactly uh, what happens. Eleven to hit. You don't hit. Okay. Did Do you, you have any twice? extra? Oh no, these ones aren't prone. Mm-hmm. No, Never these mind. ones aren't prone. Shit. Shit. But to say if you had another key and could get one prone, probably knock all the rest prone. Okay, it is um Ari's turn. You piss on it. You've got what, two left? Yeah. Yeah, it sounds about right. You haven't been burning it for extra attacks, which is smart. All right, so 19 to hit. Yep. Um, and I use key for stunning strike. So some damage, two damage, and then you got to beat a 15. Con save. Again, the one that was laughing, the idiot. Yeah, the one that got hit in the mouth. Uh, I beat it. Okay, so... Hacks. Yeah. No. Uh, you, uh, use a bonus action. To there punch. was only three. You did three damage, though? Two. Before that? Oh, two? Okay. And then I'd use bonus action to punch it. And that's an 18. So, yep, I hit, hit it. Hit. Yep. Um, four damage. And I get an extra attack. So I Hell sw- yeah, bitch. Get it. Swing that short sword again. Let's see it. 19. Yes. Fuck him up, son. And uh, six damage. Oh, thank God. I got to pee. <laughs> Hurry up! <laughs> and then I uh, use bonus action to punch it again. Uh, Thirteen. No, like I'm you done. Not <laughs> okay. Um, it is now. Uh, their turn. Dead. It's their turn. They are focused on me. Pan. They don't. They're not able to do anything. They're still woozy and a little uh, concussed. Um. That's it. They try to attack you, and the one that laughs just accidentally, like, kind of falls on you like he's drunk. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> he's trying to rape you, bro. <laughs> Rapier, barely um, knew her. Do I perceive there's, like, a particular one I should be hitting? or They're all like, the exact is there same. Anything that stands out? No. They're all okay. trying to hump Pan right now. Um, then I. I'm just going to slash with my daggers, then. Yeah. At yeah. the closest one. Go, go fucking at it, man. Um, Kick their dicks right off. Um, I don't hit. F. All right. Do you got an extra thing? Or... <laughs> Does uh, Rogue get extra attack at five? That's unfortunate if you don't. <clears throat> no. Oh, that sucks. I, it's because I have sne- I have sneak, sneak attack, attack and I have an uncanny dodge. Um, or cunning action. I don't know what cunning. A- oh, is cunning action? Oh, that's a bonus action. What's cunning? No, action? No, you're thinking of cunning lingus. What? Nothing. No, it has something to do with combat. <laughs> oh. I, I don't feel like hiding right now. <laughs> I'm good. Okay. Cutting action so, means I go and hide. Uh, Griffin's turn? Griffin's turn. However, he's eating. So roll um, roll for... You did say he was eating. Um, Roll for... No, the Griffin's just going to eat. He's going to keep eating? He's going to keep eating. Okay. If the corpse right. is still there, he's going to keep eating. If that's what you want, then... That's that's, that's what fine. the Griffin wants. I was going to have you roll for it, but... No, that's, that's what, what the, the Griffin, Griffin wants. wants. Well, you, you I just talk to why, Yeah, but I just summoned him. He's yeah. brand new. He's probably hungry. Probably and starving. First meal as angel is pretty good. Plus, we he's hanging out with... Kibbles. He and Cedric are yeah. bonding right now. Let him bond. So he let will, the kids bond. Yeah, yeah. Let, let's let two apex predators bond. That sounds like a great idea. That sounds amazing. So uh, my Griffin will just continue eating. He's all right. Then it is Pan's turn. All right. So the one that was laughing like a chuckle fuck, I'm just going <laughs> to uh, swing my warhammer at him again. You gonna hit him this time? I'm gonna absolutely <laughs> try my best. <laughs> Warhammer's gonna go in the river. Two. Uh, warhammer six. lands so in the river. I miss. I really? Yeah. Oh. Happened with the bow staffs. Okay. Yeah, you just lose grip. Slippery on it, apparently. We just hate you. Okay. Then, yeah. Um, how's Bahamut working? <laughs> with my second attack, I'm just going to punch him with my with my fist. Yeah. He's Nat a 20. little bitch. Yeah. Nat you, 20. you knock his ass out. Well, 
because I lost my hammer, I will burn a level one spell slot to divine smite him. So this will be a holy punch. Nice. So it's a two d four and four d eight. So wow. let's see how funny this guy thinks it really, really <laughs> is. <laughs> uh, there's four, uh, five, six. Yeah, he's dead. Shh. Pan, you just killed. You Seven, killed everybody. You you've hit eight, nine. blow. All right, so nine damage with my fist as the holy lightning descends from my fist through the body of this one laughing motherfucker. <laughs> so when you do that, this motherfucker... Does the body explode? <laughs> <laughs> no, it does, like, burst into, um, like, air particles. Every All of them. So, yes. All of them do. So They're yes. all gone. Oh, elf really? is still there. Dead elf is still there. I loot the elf. All those elves... Just wait. Disappeared then can my di- can, can it be lightning. super cool? My divine smite arc through every single one of them, like it jumps from target to target to target. I was actually gonna do do that yeah. in my head, but then I was. Like, oh. I take his sweet ass robes. Yeah, they are. They've got pretty good armor, so he did throw you can get his those robes off. Yeah, you can get those appraised later. All right, I, I go to and the they're nine. You, you know, these are like nine ten foot elves, so like they'll fit you. There are nine ten foot elves. <laughs> nine to ten feet. Elves. You're like, I thought there were wow. six. That's a total ninety feet. Um, I'm gonna roar to the heavens and go fucking retrieve my warhammer. <laughs> Cuss to myself about it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So Pan walks over to the river. Um, Wait. It didn't go very far. Oh, okay. I was gonna say that river's twenty feet deep. Uh, at the center, it is. It's, oh, it's, okay. Yeah. So, um, roll for perception, though. Uh, four. You can't find it. Well, that's all right, because I'm going to tell my griffin to find it. <laughs> okay. Uh, griffin, roll for perception. 14. 9, he 10, 11. It. Okay. Okay. Um, all right. And then it says, after I'm done eating, I'll go get your Warhammer. I've decided my griffin's a snarky little bastard. <laughs> he's yours, so. <laughs> Which, I mean, he's infernal. That's only fair. Um, give him a name. Rupert. No, Good just one. kidding. His name's not going to be Rupert. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, anybody want to loot? I'm looting. Start rolling. Oh I, yeah, it's a hundred, right? Or- well, I don't, I don't know what she, what's she rolling to loot the um, angel? Let's. T- are you? Yeah, because all the mini elves are gone, so we need to loot we, the angel. Do we maybe want to break and then loot the angel at the start of the next episode? Sure. So the gang takes a collective sigh of relief. <laughs> And, and battle and the Griffin and Cedric are bonding raptorally. <laughs> and that's where we will leave it for now, folks. Thanks for listening. See you next week. Bye, bye, bye. everybody. Bye. 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 Thank you for listening to Some Would Play, a production of the Outsanity Network. Join us again next week as the story continues. Find us online at www.somewoodplay.com and be sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter at somewoodplay. Deborah is at Sonia Taki. Rico is at R1C0. Jenna is at Jenna Toll. Daphne is at Dafterthought. And I am Psychedelic M. If you enjoy the show, please tell your friends and share it with others. And remember, in real life, you needn't roll for initiative, so just seize it. <laughs>